Hello and welcome back to my channel Learn with Nikhil. So in this video, I am going to teach you how to create this horizontal and vertical plane in Tinkercad. So let's begin. So it's quite simple to begin with. I'll consider a square. I'll decrease the height of the square. I'll do it around one millimeter. So I'll just make this a plane. I'll increase the length and breadth of the square. I'll make it around 100 to 100 millimeters and the height of this entire rectangle or the square will be 100 millimeter. So this will be 100 and this will also be 100. So this is how we have created a base plane. I'll just make it transparent and move it around at a height of 50 millimeters. So let's do it. So I'll increase its height. For that, I'll just make it transparent. You can change the color accordingly, transparent and you can make the necessary color you want. So you can select any color, but just see to it that you make it transparent. So it is quite visible. The planes will look exactly. I'll make this 50 as the tot entire height of the vertical plane will also be 100 millimeters. So that will be exactly at the center. I'll just make a copy of this. Control C, Control V. And I'll rotate this at an angle of 90 degrees. So that will be my vertical plane. Then I'll just move this at the center. So making it at the center, you can just select both of this, align it at the center. So this is exactly how our vertical and the horizontal plane will be. Now to just write the letters on it, the vertical plane and the horizontal plane. I'll just select a text from here. Again, decrease the height of it. You can follow how I am doing it. So I'll write here HP. That will be my horizontal plane. I'll also make this as a transparent and you can select any color you want. Decrease the height. Now our horizontal plane is written is complete. I'll just move it, align it, rotate it. So as you can see how I am adjusting it, you can change the snap grid settings. I have just duplicated it, then change its name to vertical plane and I have placing it here at the top. And this is how my vertical and the horizontal plane is done. You can also create one more plane on the side which can be the profile plane. Select the box change it to orthographic view you can see the front top and side view the hidden lines also can be seen by just changing the transparency you can group this and you can make it a whole block thank you for watching do subscribe to my channel if you have any doubts any queries let me know in the comment section